Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn how to solve this challenging intro from the MIT integration B. Alright, we need to calculate the anti-derivative of 1 over 1 minus psi s squared ds. Alright, in order to do this one, we need to multiply the top and bottom by this one conjugate. So it's going to be the intro of 1 plus psi s altogether square over 1 minus psi s times 1 plus psi s altogether square, right? Now, psi note 1 minus psi s times 1 plus psi s it could be 1 minus psi square of s, right? But 1 minus psi square of s is could be cosine square of s, right? So, the bottom can be written as cosine to the 4 of s, right? The top, you need to expand the top, it could be 1 plus 2 psi s plus psi square of s, right? ds. Now, I must split this one into three intervals, right? So the first one is going to be 1 over cosine to the 4 of s ds. The second one should be 2 psi s over cosine to the 4 of s ds and the third one should be integral of psi square of s over cosine to the 4 of s ds right now I'm gonna call this one is i1 this one is i2 and this one is i3 right now I need to calculate each of this one right so the first one, I1 equals 1 over cosine to the 4 of s. You know that. 1 over cosine s equals secant s, right? So this guy is the same thing as secant to the 4 of s ds, right? Now you can split secant to the 4 into secant square of s times secant square of s ds, right? Now you know that secant square of s is going to be 1 plus tangent square of s, right? So I have 1 plus tangent square of s, right? And I need to rewrite secant square of s ds, right? Now I'm going to use u substitution, right? So I let u be tangent s, right? So then du equals secant square of s ds, right? Alright, so i1 equals anti-derivative of 1 plus u square times du, right? Now, we are taking anti-derivative of this one. It's going to be u plus u q over 3, right? plus c. Now I'm going to substitute. Now I'm going to substitute tangent s for u. So it's going to be tangent s plus tangent q of s over 3 plus c. Right? Alright, let's move on to i2. i2 equals 2 in row of psi s over cosine to the 4 of s ds, right? Now we know that psi s over cosine s could be tangent s, right? So I just split cosine to the 4 of s into cosine s times cosine qs, right? To the integral of psi s over cosine s could be tangent s, right? Now, 1 over cosine cube of s is going to be 
second Q S D S right now this guy is the same thing as to the interval of tension S times second S times second square of S D S right now we're gonna use U substitution to solve this one. Let's use B second S. Then D use equals second S tension S D S, right? So you have I two is the same thing as the integral of U square D U, right? So it's going to be 2 over 3 u q plus c. And then you substitute second s for u, right? So it could be 2 over 3 second q s plus c. This is the answer for the second one, right? Now the last one, i3. Now cosine to the four of s can be written as cosine square of s times cosine square of s, right? So you have sine square of s divided by cosine square of s. It could be tangent square of s, right? And then you have one over cosine square of s. It could be second square of s, and then ds, right? Now you're gonna use u substitution again. You're gonna let u be tangent s. Then d yields equals second square of s ds, right? So then i3 becomes the integral of u square d u, right? So it could be u cube over 3 plus c. And then you substitute tangent s for u, right? So it could be tangent q of s over 3 plus c, right? So this one is the answer for the i3, right? Now you're gonna add i1, i2, i3, right? So this one i less, this one b, i, right? So i becomes i1, which means tension s plus tension Q of S over 3, right? Plus I2, it could be 2 third second Q of S and then plus I3, which means tension Q of S over 3, right? And then I'm gonna add a constant C, which means I let this one is C1, this is C2, and this one is C3. C1 plus C2 plus C3 equals a new C, right? So I'm going to combine these two guys right here. Tension Q of S over 3 and tension Q of S over 3. So this guy becomes, and then this one is the final answer. Now, if you have another way to solve this problem, please leave a comment and it's your time to solve. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Remember that. If you fail failing to prepare, you're repairing to fail. We rise like tall buildings As the chemicals, they take us higher The night's young and it's just begun As she puts her hand in mine